Hey, what's up guys? John Muro here and we got a new video for you today for you today. So I just got off of work. The boss gave the thumbs up said man You guys can cut out early and you know what we had to do So the cool thing is I'm like five minutes away from uh, Old Hickory Lake So I got my fishing pole and I'm gonna give set myself a goal. How many fish can I catch in 30 minutes? Uh, big shout out to John B Hey man, I watch all your videos. They're awesome. I'm subscribed. So big shout out to John B. This guy, he's awesome. And so I really appreciate all the videos he puts out there. And I'm a big fan. So shout out to him. And uh, definitely would love any feedback, guys, any comments down below. So I'm here in Tennessee. I don't really see a lot of people make videos on fishing in Tennessee they do with bass and catfish and all stuff it's like everywhere else uh so we just want to bring you guys into gallatin tennessee at old hickory lake and uh, let's see what we catch i got 30 minutes let's see what happens all right guys so uh, i don't have my boat today and it's just the radar has said if anybody that lives in tennessee knows one day it could say it's bright and sunny and that day when it comes, it's snowing, it's a tsunami, there's tornadoes everywhere. And then when it says it's gonna be really cold and it's gonna be storming, it could be the best day ever. So that's Tennessee weather for you guys. So I didn't bring my boat, but I've got my, uh, some tackle here. And I brought my bait caster with some good stuff. Check that lure out right there. Yeah. So guys, um, I'm just going to come down here and fish off the bank. I cannot tell you guys when the last time that I fished off the bank. I kind of miss it. You know, I, I see a lot of John B's videos and the majority of what he's fished starting out was always on the bank, always somewhere. And then, of course, he would, you know, join friends that had a boat. So I'm like, man, I'm right here. I didn't bring my boat. I got some stuff to do tonight, but why not go ahead and take some time out and do what we like to do fish you know catch some fish man hey whatever i catch hey it's all good so uh i gotta be careful here this spot looks kind of really enclosed but let's uh check it out guys and tell me what you guys think and we're gonna try to catch some fish i got 30 minutes to see how many fish i catch so the truck is up there i just walked down uh there's rocks there's bridge and uh, just this little area guys and I'm gonna walk it and just see if I can catch anything like I said I only got 30 minutes to make some magic happen let's get started Well guys, I had a fish following it and uh, he let he stopped right there. Oh yeah. There he is. There he is. There he is. <laughs> there he is. There he is. Alright. There he is. Check it out, guys. Let me get better in this lower light. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's a nice one. All right, so that's one. What do you think, guys? Well, that's a good one. There's one. He's a beauty, guys. All right, there you go. All right, fish number one, guys. And just caught me fish number uno. What's up, guys? Hey, 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 I gotta say this, I gotta say this. You didn't have me at hello. You had me at fishing. What's up, let's keep fishing. All right, that first fish was nice. I knew what we got, oh man, what's going on? Somebody else's, somebody else's line, not my line, okay. I knew there was something out here. Yeah, got that. Got that. See, there's a rock. I don't, I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a rock down there where 
uh, when I brought my boat before and I, I never really been down here in my new boat but in my John boat there would be fish just everywhere in this area oh man I got stuff on it oh it came off but yeah they're they're everywhere in this area and I had like I said I had uh, one fish follow me and I saw him right there till he got close and then he kind of just turned the other way and then that guy a while ago I mean I'm just throwing it in the same direction just keep it coming and then they're following it but that color guys on that crankbait it's just uh, I had a guy tell me he fishes all these tournaments in this area he said man he said that's the best color you can get and uh, it's my buddy so I appreciate him letting me use that I don't know if he knows that I got it but I appreciate it anyways shout out to you Dilio Come on guys, come on, we need another fish. We got one within the five, first five minutes and we're hoping to catch some more. Oh, this one feels a whole lot different. That's crazy how much different this feels. Oh yeah, he's got that crazy spin action going on. Oh yes, we got some distance now. Oh yeah. uh-huh there he is guys oh uh, yeah there he is he saw he saw him he saw him in distress he saw him in distress oh yeah that's a good one i'm gonna stay right here because the light was bad a while ago All right, fish number two. So, uh, like I said, I got hung up in all that, uh, all that string and stuff, and so I had to redo everything. But I'm back in action. Like I said, there is so many fish out there. Yeah, it was a messed up. Oh yeah, there it is. There it is. There he is. There he is, guys. There he is yeah oh what in the world what is this guys hey we catch whatever look at this hey it don't matter we will take it we will take it all right guys 30 minutes three fish two bass and a bluegill not bad because i haven't fished this spot in like three years so uh stay tuned for the next episode like and subscribe hit that like button and uh, give it a thumbs up guys